Hello guys, in this video we will see how to download and install Oracle Linux 9.5 on VirtualBox. Go to Oracle official website that is oracle.com Then click on products Then scroll down Then click on Linux Then click on download Oracle Linux Then click on this ISO images Oracle installation media for x86 64 click on it see here we have the different types of iso images you can go through them and you can select the respective iso and download it and i am going to download full iso that is dvd iso see here we have the version different versions but the latest version is oracle 9.5 and see here we have the full iso d boot iso source iso i am going with full iso that is dvd iso click on it to download see download has been started go to downloads see here it's a size is 11.7 gigabytes i'm cancelling this one because i have already downloaded in your case wait until download completes see i have already downloaded Vara Linux 9.5 dvd iso not only dvd we can also download boot iso okay? okay it is up to you so once download is completed then open oracle vm virtual box if you want to install Oracle VM virtual box on your machine, then go through the link provided in the video description and install it. Virtual box. Click on it. Now click on new or machine and select new. Both are same to create the virtual machine. Select either of them, then provide the name. I am giving virtual machine name as then select the folder to store this virtual machine and files and folders by default it is going to store in this directory but i i want to save them in then select the downloaded iso image select other then select the downloaded Oracle Linux 9.5 and click on open. Then by the, once you selected the DVD ISO, it automatically selected type as Linux, subtype as Oracle Linux, version as Oracle Linux 9.5. And select this skip unattended installation checkbox. If you don't select it automatically installs. So select this one. Then hardware. By default, it is going to select 2 gigabytes. I want to increase it to 4 gigabytes. Number of CPU processors, I am going with 2. Hard disk, I am going with 100 gigabytes. Then click on finish. Still, if you want edit settings, just right click on it and select the settings. Or select the virtual machine from this list and select machine and select settings. Or just click on settings. For working with all the settings, just click on start. The only option that I am going to change is click on settings, then system, then point device to USB tablet and cl click on OK. Then click on start or right click and start then normal start. Both are same. So click on start to start the installation of Oracle Linux 9.5. Close this one. Use the up and down arrows and select the first option that is install Oracle Linux 9.5 and hit enter. Then select the language and click on continue. See, the beginning installation has been grayed out. Why? Because the options are the items that are marked with Red color must be filled. So click on installation destination. I am okay with the default one. So click on done. Then we have to set the password for root, root account. So provide password. Then click on done. Now optionally create user. Click on user creation. Provide user full name. Then select the checkbox. Make this user as administrator. Then provide the password. Then click on done. Now next software selection. See here we have the base environment like server with UI, server, minimal install, 
workstation, custom operating system, virtualization host, and these are the additional softwares that we can select. I'm going with server with UI. Then click on suppose if you want to select DNS name, name server, you have to select these check boxes. Okay, I'm not going to select, but this is the way to select. Click on done. Now click on begin installation to start the installation of Oracle Linux 9.5 on virtual box. Click on it. See, installation has been started. This will take time. So I am pausing this video until whenever it will ask us to reboot the system. Then we will perform the post installation steps. See, installation has been completed. Now click on reboot system. Click on it. Now click on username, then provide the password. Click on no thanks. Click on activities, then open terminal. Now verify the version of Oracle Linux that we have installed. More slash etc os hyphen release. See, we have installed Oracle Linux 9.5. The first step after connecting to Oracle Linux is we have to update the packages sudo dnf update and upgrade the packages sudo dnf upgrade See, it is going to install 4 packages and upgrading 62 packages. Type Y and hit enter. This may take time. So, in this video, we have seen how to download and install Oracle Linux 9.5 on VirtualBox. For more Linux tutorials, please subscribe my channel. Thank you.